COVID patients, when they come in, require oxygen therapy, and that may range from just nasal oxygen all the way up to going on intensive care unit where you have to then apply mechanical ventilation. So the concern with ventilator supply during COVID was that the sheer number of patients coming in at any given time, this would lead to a shortfall of ventilators in our hospitals. At the Institute for Manufacturing, we have been working in the healthcare theme for many years. And when the COVID pandemic hit and that first lockdown hit, we really could see the pressure that our clinician colleagues were under. And we really felt the need to try and help. So one of the ideas that we developed in collaboration with IFM was if we could use one ventilator for ventilating two patients safely, then potentially this idea would have implication of doubling the capacity, as we call it. We designed a device that would allow a single flow of air from a single ventilator to be divided and shared with multiple patients and to meet their individual needs. And we worked with the Cambridge Design Partnership as well to help us understand how do we take this design and modify it so that it will be safe and go through the regulatory procedures to show that it's safe for use. The device itself is compact, portable. It has capacity to monitor not only the respiratory rate, but the airway pressures, the concentration of oxygen going, and it's got built-in valves so that the airflow is directed in one direction and also has built-in antimicrobial filters to avoid cross-contamination between patients. The design we came up with is deliberately very easy and quick to set up because it needs to be used in an emergency situation. You don't want to have to spend time thinking about what to connect where. We needed to make it using parts that were available within the UK supply chain and in particular the supply chain already accessed by UK hospitals. This has potential implications for its use not only in hospitals but in humanitarian aid situations where potentially there is need for rapid deployment of capacity. IFM and Royal Papworth Hospital tested the ventilator splitting device on artificial lungs. The results have been encouraging and they exceed our expectations in compared to all the other devices that are available in the market. Working on the ventilator sharing device really showed us that when there is a shared need, a real shared passion to deliver a project, and you've got the collaborative partnerships there, you can do it really quickly. The COVID pandemic led to incredible personal and professional challenges. The ventilator sharing device response brought people together. We had an amazing result that will provide benefits to patients in the future, but also has brought together a team that has started working on the new challenges, the next challenges of the future.